Come on, you can do it. Well, we're back at another errand day. We're back doing the vlog. I haven't updated in like a week because Seth was sick and then I was sick and I'm still a little bleh, but I'm okay. There's just some stomach ick, you know? Like the kind of stuff you don't want to have while you're making a video. But all that being said, we're doing laundry right now. Seth had me, well, I requested to stay in the car because it's hot. I don't feel great. And there was a really creepy kind of drugged out guy in the laundry mat when we went in earlier. So he was like, why don't you just wait and not come in? So we've gotten errands done really fast today. It's just 3.30 right now. And then we're gonna head to my mom's house because she has some medicine for me. And you may ask, you know, it's good to do the vlog again though, though it's been a while. And I've put up a video on my main channel. I'll have another one out today, optimistically. But when you see it, it'll, this, it'll be yesterday. We're gonna run errands today. And then I think Seth said that he would help me fix up the back patio. We put out our patio furniture <laughs> that we got from Ikea a couple of days ago and we need to like throw some old stuff away and move some stuff around back there because so we have some planters and stuff we'll finally get that fixed it's just so hot that like we ate lunch out there and it's just really too hot like you just about die eating out there i'll keep you posted beautiful out here so we just got out of the shower but before that we went to my mom's we got the medicine acquired and ah, i hate it and we cleaned off our back deck and it is beautiful we had a table out here that was just kind of garbage we have this new table that we got from ikea and it's really nice i'll show you more in a moment but i feel like there's so much more space out here now that's very nice today's been really good though i started out not feeling great this morning you know we persevere you know don't go into the world if you like have what i have a question this has carrots in it want to fish the carrots out of the old individual. It's still better because it has baby corns. Thank you. So, Seth is making dinner. We might eat out here if it's still light out, which it should be. I've got laundry to put away, but I was able to just pull my truck around right there and haul off that table. So nice to have a truck. You know, people really sleep on like having a pickup truck, but man, juiceful. It has been just a lovely day though. I love summer days like this. I wish there were more of them. And it's nice that it's August. It's nice that school's about to start. But anyways, let me show you around. So you walk out there, our plants, our tomato plant is doing wonderful even though he's big. Um, we've got our pool floaties. So we have a pool, a mint. There's our little patio furniture. It's super cute from Ikea, very affordable. And then <laughs> this over here, another little gardeny spot is very nice. We just have a nice view of the neighborhood from here. But I'm quite happy. These chairs are actually really comfortable. They don't look like they would be, but they are in fact. Sorry, there was no feature of Pete in this vlog. We weren't at my parents very long because my mom had to go do some finishing touches for her school because she goes back to school tomorrow which is crazy, I don't feel good about it. Her school, much like most of the Southern United States, is not taking COVID precautions very seriously. And she and I are both like pretty at risk. And so I'm scared for her. I've like, I was with her when I met some of her parents and they didn't seem to give a shit at all about like the teacher's safety. They were just like inconvenienced that their kid wasn't in school. And I get it, like parents have to work, but at the same time, the teachers are not making enough to risk their livelihood for something they didn't even sign up for. So that's my stance and I'm stressed about it. So if you wouldn't mind praying for my mom and her safety as she goes back to school, that would be awesome because it's stressful. My school got moved online though. Mine and Seth's classes are all online. Thank goodness. So I don't have to be on campus at all next semester and I feel really good about that. I'm in an ideal situation right now for myself and my safety. We just have mom to worry about. <laughs> so fingers crossed things will be okay. But you know, I'm gonna go back and help with dinner and stuff. You're beautiful. That's for sure. What? <laughs> There's not enough. I did not put enough stuff in it. Okay, you're right. I'm sorry. You screwed I'm, up for all of us. I'm dumb and I ruin everything. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you're wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> ah. You're very sweet. Oh sweet, thank you. I have to give okay. you a nice white kiss. Time for dinner. Look at the atrocity. Atrocity. That has been done in my face. Maybe it'll be better this way, you can see. Hi, Egg. Hello. Survived one cat attack. I got attacked. 
I was trying to put away the laundry in the drawer and my little gremlin child was in the drawer and I got her out and she bit my face. <laughs> Which she doesn't usually do that, so yeah. that's very odd. Being an asshole, sometimes she gets that um, little teenage rebellion going on. She's like, fuck you, man, this is empty. She does, and I kind of suspect it's because we haven't been around a whole lot this week. Yeah, she should be alright. But also, there's no need to act out. We got all the laundry put away, and we have completed all of our tasks for the day. And it is quite wonderful. Now well, he's gotta make the bed. And we are gonna go to bed early and watch the first episode of Star Trek Lower Decks. I've already watched it, but I'm very excited for Sep to watch it. And then, that's a whole, that's a whole day right there. Do you have any final thoughts? I'm tired. God, me too. Well, we're going to go get ready for bed, and let's hope that my nose heals up all right. It should. We'll be okay. No, it's just the nose. It's no worse than the time Seth broke mine. He didn't mean to. We were just dancing, and he elbowed me in the face. But we'll be okay. Anyways, night.